In this video, we're going to finally view our project in VR. So we will start off with testing out the level in virtual reality and seeing how the basic navigation controls work. And we'll finish it off with um, how to create a package which will allow other people to view the project without the need for 3ds Max Interactive. In the last video, we made the ground collidable, which accomplished two things. So the first is that it stopped the user from falling through the ground when we started the level. Uh, but the other important thing for VR is that it made this ground a valid teleportation surface. So any surface that's collidable and perfectly horizontal can be teleported to, and we'll see that when we test our, our level. The other thing we did is that we created a player start which will determine where the user will be when we start our level. So I have my VR equipment hooked up. That It is an HTC Vive. I have the Steam VR software running, so we're ready to go. So let's go ahead and test this out. So here we are in VR. Um, I will pick up my headset. And if I move it around, you can see that it is working, but this is not a very good way for me to present this. So let me go ahead and put on my headset and I will join you in a bit. Here we are in VR. If I rotate my head, I can look around and in my hand, I'm holding the Vive controller, which will allow me to teleport around the level. Now, this is accomplished by this big button on the face of the controller, which I hope you can see well here. So holding down on this button shows me where I can teleport to with this green arc that you see. If I can't teleport to an area, the arc will disappear, as you can see. And in this case, you can see that anywhere on this ground, I can teleport to. But the front loader will not work because we did not make it um, collidable. So once I've decided where I want to teleport to, I let go of the button and you can see that it makes me jump to that area. The other way to navigate is to simply walk around in real life so I can walk closer or farther away and combine that with teleportation. One limitation of VR is that there's nothing stopping you from poking your head through objects like we see here. Even if we made the front loader collidable, it would make no difference. The reason is, is that we can stop your virtual head from poking through, but your real life head can still keep on going, which causes a disconnect and that can be quite disorienting, so we just don't try to stop it at all. So once we've tested out our level and everything is to our satisfaction, um, we can now create a package which is a version that can be run without the need to have 3ds Max Interactive installed. So it's self-contained. So I'm gonna go into Window, Deploying, Connect, and then Deployer. We do have different platforms we can deploy to, but I'm just going to use Windows for now. Choose the destination. If this is the final version, choose release, give it a name, so something like front loader, and then package project for Windows. 